everyone crystal here and we're back to cut sangria punch and this is what it looks like very pretty and i just wanted to take a second um to thank each and every single one of you guys that commented that are sending prayers that that donated they all mean so much to me words cannot explain or describe how just how much that means to me your prayers means more than anything in this world to me right now I mean just you guys supporting me and being there for me and you know and th those of you that's donated thank you so much and I seen on there where I've got 18 shares on Facebook that is awesome you guys are really helping me out I'm gonna quit buddy uh, you guys are really helping me out, and I just wanted to take a minute to sit down and, I mean, not sit down, but just take a minute to say thank you and just know that you guys are appreciated. Um, I, I'm just lost for words. You guys have just supported me so much, and just your kind words and your support, just everything you've done, I just, I can't thank you enough. Like, there's words that can't describe how much I appreciate it. So please know that you guys are very much appreciated. I mean, that's coming from me and my husband and all my kids. Um, I just really appreciate you. So I just wanted to put that out there first. So I promised a cutting video. So we're going to go ahead and get this cut. Let me tighten up my wire here. All right, let's get it in piece. Ooh, that, that looks. This might be pretty. Let me get a paper towel here. Alright guys, let's go ahead and get this cut. Oh wow, there's one side. You see where I actually kind of didn't cut that well. But look at that. Isn't that gorgeous? How, look how pretty. And the orange, like I knew it would. It morphed into like this peach color. And there's the top. Love the top. Oh wow, see, this is absolutely beautiful. Oh my gosh, look at this swirls, you guys. That is wonderful, that is so pretty. And it smells so good, let me tell you. It smells so good. I love the Sangria Punch. And I sold out of this uh, Sangria Punch when I first started going to my shows. I sold out of it like that, which I've not been able to go for the past couple of weeks. I love it. Um, I've not been able to set up and go to my shows for the past couple of weeks because of some things that's been going on. Uh, like I said in my other video, I have other things that are going on besides the deal with the house. So, I mean, you guys just praying for me means the world to me. So, um, I, the reason why I said that is because I've not been able to set up um here lately uh, i've not been back which they know i've called them and i've kind of explained a little bit to them what's going on they have saved my spot for me isn't that pretty but um they saved my spot for me and i told them that i'm going to try to come back next weekend that's what i plan on doing i'm hoping i can make it next weekend just everything that's been going on i just haven't really had time to go out there and I have to work on my soaps that are coming out of Cure. I just have, not, I've just been so behind on everything. I've not been able to wrap them. I mean, I've got tons of soap that needs to be wrapped that has came out of Cure, that's cured already. And I'm just behind on everything, guys. I mean, I need to get caught up on a lot of stuff. But, oh my gosh, these swirls are absolutely beautiful. And I love the colors together. Usually, I try for a, um, a vibrant orange. But this soap, I think that that peachy color looks really good compared to up against the dark blue and the pink. I really like that. Um, I have troubles. Me and oranges just don't get along, guys. Orange mica is my nemesis. I cannot find an orange mica that's not a neon that will actually show up and be a true orange it always morphs into like a peach color unless i use the neon and the neon's just a little bit too bright for me i mean i like the neon orange on some things 
but I just wish I could get a true orange. But in this case, I don't mind the peach color because I think it goes with it really well. I mean, these swirls are just so pretty. And there's the top again. So I am absolutely loving this soap. It's gorgeous and it smells divine. It's one of my favorite scents. As you guys know, if you've watched my other videos, I am a sucker for sangria scents. I love anything that's sangria. And this one is the Sangria Punch. And I absolutely adore it. I just think it smells so good. And just the colors and the swirl matches it perfectly, I feel. I love it. So pretty. Oh wow, look at that one. Oh my gosh, look at that one you guys. Gorgeous. And I don't have my fan going. And I'm sitting here pouring down sweat like usual. But I wanted to go ahead and get this cut. I'm not sure when I'm going to upload it because I would like the, the making video to be out for a couple days before I upload this, the cutting video. Um, but I promise I'll have it get it uploaded for you all so you can see the finished product because even though I talked with you guys um, I still made a soap so and that just made a sliver so this is the end piece alright awesome guys so alright so that was the cutting of Sangria Punch I think it turned out absolutely beautiful I am really happy with it even though the pe the orange did turn into a peachy color, I think it suits it perfectly. Alright guys, so if you like this video and if you want to see future videos, then hit the subscribe button. And if you like this video, please thumbs up and leave me a comment. Um, it does make my day when you guys comment. I love it. It puts a smile on my face and I will write back to you. Alright guys, so uh, until the next video, I'll talk to you later. Bye-bye.